What's up, YouTube? Um, thank you guys for tuning into my channel. Um, this is actually my first video that I'm making about reptiles of Ohio, and today's reptile is the northern water snake. Ooh, buddy. Uh, the northern water snake is a very colorful snake, very pretty, especially when they're babies. I mean, they've got very bright bands, um, and when I first saw my first water snake, I thought it was a water moccasin, only because, you know, an experience and I really know what I was looking at. Um, in fact, though, actually, to my knowledge, uh, water, I'm in, uh, southwest Ohio, and we'll get copperheads, uh, Massasauga rattlesnakes and timber rattlesnakes, but, um, no, no cottonmouths. I mean, they, they're down in southwest Kentucky, uh, the state below us, and, um, they're not even found a ton there either, but, um, yeah, so, they get mistaken for that a lot, and unfortunately they get killed, um, the other snake that kind of looks like these guys, in my opinion, are like um, the milk snake. I mean, some really dull colored milk snakes kind of look like these guys. I mean, milk snakes are way more colorful than this, but um, as far as water moccasins go, I mean, they're they're almost black with just faint bands on the sides, and they've got that stripe by their eye. And These guys, real smooth. I mean, just long and skinny. I mean fat and round are the, the water moccasins, and they're mean, they're mean little guys, but um, they don't attack people like people say, but we're going to focus on this guy. So you're going to find these guys around water streams, um, something that's on rocks, hanging over branches um, and trees over the water, um, or just, just stick piles, you know, if you see like uh, drifts of wood and sticks that are on the side of the bank, I mean, they like to sit in those too. Um, they feed mostly on fish, frogs, crayfish, you know, crawdads, um, sometimes small mammals, you know, just things they can fit their mouth around just like most snakes. Um, they, they aren't venomous at all by any means. I mean, if you get bit by this snake, I mean, you are going to want to wash it out just like any other thing, you know, just to prevent infection and stuff like that. Um, they're, they're, you know, pretty aggressive when you first catch them. I mean, they're going to try to bite you as much as they can. Um, just because of defense, you know, they don't want to be attacked or eaten or whatever it may be. So, um, they're going to bite. Um, as you can see with this guy, he just kind of is hanging out, not really caring about what I do. Um, I've had him for a day and a half now. I'm going to let him go after I make this video, but, um, I caught him just swimming through the water, but, um, he's not trying to bite me at all. He's just kind of wanting to, you know, hang out, get away, whatever, you know. Um, he did just wake up and I've got the sun over here, so he's probably going to want to sun himself a little bit because that's what they do. As you can see, he's going that way. But, um, but yeah, identifying these guys, I mean, they've got, uh, this, he's a, um, he's about a teenager. I mean, he's, well, he's a juvenile. I mean, they're going to get to be about two and a half to three feet long. They can get a lot bigger than that. They get big around too. Um, but he's, he's all right. I mean, he's got, you can see he's got very noticeable stripes on them bands. Um, and like I said, you know, they faint, they fade away when they get bigger, um, but they're still noticeable, you can still see them. Um, round eyes, um, in North America, the round eyes, um, and no noticeable pits and second pit on the side of their face, um, and no diamond-shaped head, will indicate that it's um, non-venomous, if it doesn't have those. Um, now, if it does have those, then it is venomous. Other parts of the world, that is not that is not 100% accurate at all. I mean, the top three most venomous snakes in the world have circular eyes and an oval head, but when these guys get mad, they're going to flatten their bodies out and their heads are going to push down to think they're venomous, and that's a lot of times when people think. But um, you think about like rat snakes and other snakes like that, they flicker their tails in the leaves to um, warn off predators, and um, this guy's going to try to make himself look as venomous as possible just to, you know, keep himself alive. But, um, but I mean, they're... They're pretty cool snakes. I mean, I've been catching them all my life. I mean, like I said, I'm in Southwest Ohio, and um, they're all over the place down here, along with queen snakes, rat snakes, um, garter snakes. You know, everyone's got garter snakes, right? But uh, but they're really cool. I mean, he's just a chill little guy. But Nerodia sipidon, that's their that's their name. So, northern water snake. All right, guys, we'll see you in the next video.